Hello everyone, this is Joseph K. Welcome back to more Let's Play Tales of the Abyss, 100%. In the last part, uh... These people hopped on our... Dreadnought, land ship, whatever the hell you want to call it, and they, uh... Made off with, um... Foam Master Ion. Even though Anna's supposed to protect him. Um... So now we have to figure out how to take control of Tartars. Let's go this way. The elevator isn't working. I expected as much. What do we do? Is there any other way out? Somewhere in one of these rooms should be something fun we can use to escape. Something fun? Colonel, what are you talking about? It wouldn't be as fun if I told you, now would it? Let's search the rooms around here. Okay. I sure hope nobody spots us. Honestly, I don't know if I got that scene before. It when I first when I did it when I did my uh, like notes for this, I did get the scene then, and I don't know if I did it before or not. But we come down here to this room to the left and get all these treasure chests and a block puzzle. Now, block puzzles are a staple in many RPG. I'm not going to put the way how to get this, but you go over there and get 1200 gold. Get style, which is a capacity core, which we can't equip right now. But yeah, I'm not going to put how to do this. This is a very simple block puzzle. Uh, some of the later ones, because there will be block puzzles later. I'll figure out how to write that down. Because it's... <sighs> It'd be very difficult for me to explain. But anyways, we get a couple items here. 12, 1200 gold, style, and a life bottle. Um... I'm not sure if he'll tell us to skip this room or not. Up, oh, spoiler alert. Wait, please. This is... What is it? Uh, let's skip this one for now and search the other rooms. Alright, whatever you say, Jade. Alright, let's see here. Well... I guess there's only one place to go. I've been showing this off. <clears throat> There's nothing in here. It's just a room identical to the room we were just in when we got in prison, and we just it's just flipped. Um, this is the room we were in, and I think this is another one of those rooms that's identical, just flipped. Yeah. Just showing that off so that you guys know, so you can just go ahead and skip this stuff. All right, but we want to go to this room. Ah, nice toilet. Go in here. Open this chest. Wow, they didn't take them very far. And they aren't even guarding them. I imagine they were guarding them originally. Right now, they're probably busy trying to revive the Tartarus. Let's go. Hey, we get our equipment back. Yay! Now. Now we should be able to put that capacity core. Uh, style. We'll give you Phonic Attack and Enhancement. I actually want to put style on Luke right now. Because I need Luke to uh, get his enhancement up considerably. So we'll do that. As far as what everybody else is on... I say we're fine to go ahead and keep him on that. For now, we'll switch capacity cores later. But yeah, definitely put the style on Luke. I don't have that in my notes, but it's what you want to do. I don't have it in my notes because I'm doing all my notes from a New Game Plus file, and I already have all the capacity cores. Hurry! We haven't got time for detours. We have to get into position before those Oracle guys get back. 
That's an interesting skit. Um, because it looks like he's talking to us as the player. Okay, apologies for that cut. My nose was bothering me, and I had something I had to look at real quick. Not my notes, uh, something else. Alright, now that we've got our weapons, uh, let's go over here to the door that Jade said not to enter before. Ah, here we are. We'll find our something fun in the back, behind these boxes. So, we just need to move these boxes then? That's right. By the way, Luke, I can't say I think much of you forcing a woman to do the heavy lifting. I'm fine, Colonel. Or do rich aristocratic boys lack any muscles? <sighs> and here I thought even your brain was made of muscle. What did you say? Wait a minute. You're a guy, too. You help out. No, I'd rather not. You're younger than I am, after all. At my age, all my joints ache. Fine, whatever. Out of the way, I'll do it. <laughs> Thanks. You can do it, Master! I thought I told you to shut up. Hey, this is just giving you a tutorial how to do this, and, well, yeah, I got it. We, we already did it. You walk up to an item... Oh, see, skit. Let's get moving. We don't know how many of the six god generals attacked the Tartarus. Are there more here besides that Largo, the black line you took down before? At least three. One controlling the Ligers and Griffins, and the ones that attacked us at the bridge. We have no chance against them like this. <clears throat> Granted, they took us by surprise, but we were still both down in an instant. If we could take them by surprise instead, like with Largo, things would be different. But we can't count on that happening again. And for whatever reason, it kind of uh, slows it down. But uh, what was I? I was doing something. Damn it! Oh well. Oops. Oh yeah. By the way, that, that's what I was doing. Uh, we already know how to do it. You move up, go approach a crate, hit X, grab it, left, right, whatever. It's easy. But I'm gonna control Jade for a little bit now. Oh, it doesn't do anything, it's just what I'm going to do. But, basically... You can move this any number of ways. I did it the most difficult way. Figure out however you want to do it. I shouldn't have to tell you how to do that block puzzle. It's fairly easy. Here it is. This is your something fun? Colonel, is that gunpowder? Gunpowder? Why is that here? A group of soldiers aboard the ship had been pilfering supplies to sell on their own. I discovered that they'd been hiding gunpowder here. Though this commotion has made my investigation pointless. I see. So we're going to ignite this and destroy the wall. Are you serious? Oh, yeah, right there. It, he says, you sure that's going to be okay? Uh, for whatever reason, that line of dialogue is not there. I don't know if it was, like, something that got cut by accident, or is it something they cut for space? I'm not sure, but yeah. We'll be fine as long as we're not caught in the explosion. Now let's hurry. Do we light it with the phonic art? No, we light it with Mew. You're on, Mew. Which is technically lighting it with a phonic art, since Mew can spit fire. Yes, sir! Whoa, wait a- Jeez, could have waited half a second. Mew! I'm sorry, Master. No, that was perfect, Mew. Now, let us be going. Right. How can those two watch an explosion go off right in their faces? I swear. Oops, my bad. I did cut that dialogue. But we come over here, examine this, and we get a longsword, which is a weapon for Luke. 
and better than what we currently have. Honestly, though, I think that explosion would have been a lot more explosive. It was way, way too contained for a box of gun there. A, got bleh, bleh, a box of gunpowder. Anyways, go out here. What are they trying to do? What are these guys trying to accomplish by kidnapping Ion? Well, Ion is working to avoid war. So perhaps they're trying to disrupt the peace talks. Given Ion's influence on both Kimlaska and Malkuth, his presence is critical to the peace process. Preventing him from reaching Batako would certainly be the most direct and effective method to disrupt that process. But attacking a Malkuth military vessel just for that? It makes me wonder. You think there could be more to it? What do you mean? In the final conjecture, let's discuss this after we're, we've taken care of the present situation. Yeah, what are they doing? What are they hoping to accomplish? I think that's actually the last skit we can get here. Just uh, do a quick double t check at my... Uh... Yep, that's it. No more skits. Alright, now let's get out of here. Oh, come on. There you go. Sometimes I find it difficult to get on these ladders. It's got a very small hitbox at times. Anyways, let's, uh, well, I guess we're gonna go to the bridge. The exit is right here. Let's hurry. Oh, okay. Hey, hey, all right. Now, last fight with the Griffin, we got beef. Eh, hey, let's fight this Liger. All right, or I should say Ligar. Ain't you no, know, I was inquiring about why couldn't they just call the enemy a Liger instead of a Ligar? Well, I figured out why. But we'll see here. Uh, not, probably not this. No, definitely not this recording session. And let's get to the scene real quick. It looks like we made it in time. There they are. How do you even see them, Jade? Have they realized the Tartarus did an emergency shutdown? I'd be rather surprised if they haven't. What a stupid question, Luke. More importantly, we can't use phonic arts. There's no time for casting. It's not like you can use any decent phonic arts anyway with that phone slot seal. How can you say things like that? The Colonel's been working hard to undo the phone slot seal. I don't mind. It's the truth. Open the emergency hatch. Right away. <laughs> Fire! Now! That face. Jade Curtis, you're a force to be reckoned with, even with your phonic guard sealed. That's quite a compliment. I'm on. Now, throw down your weapon. Phonic him. Tear? Tear grants? Major Legretta. She's supposed to be a sharpshooter, yet her. Aim sucks. 
like throughout the whole game, her aim Master, sucks. We're surrounded. We're not surrounded, Mew. Arietta, what's happened to the Tartarus? Oh, Arietta. It's still inoperable. I was only able to get this far because my friend tore open the wall. Good work. Restrain them and. For the record, I absolutely hate Arietta. Like, I hate her. She is by far the worst character in this game. Enter the amazing guy. Kind of kinky. Uh, Arietta. Now, drop your weapons once more and go back inside the Tartarus. <laughs> I absolutely love how Jade is basically going to kill this little girl. That is absolutely amazing. But, you know, I fucking hate Arietta. Like, I hate her. You're next. Take your monster inside. Phone master, I... I... Please, do as he says, Arietta. All the hatches should stay closed for a while. Phew, thank goodness. Good timing, guy. I looked all over for you. Never thought you'd turn up in a place like this. By the way, Ion, where's Annis? The enemy stole the Emperor's letter. Annis went to get it back, but a monster knocked her out of a porthole. But I heard soldiers say that they couldn't find the body, so I'm hoping she's all right. Then let's head for St. Bina. That's our rendezvous point with Annis. St. Bina? It's a city to the southeast of here. Okay, we just need to make it there, right? What about your troops? They're still inside the ship, right? I can't imagine there being any survivors. If they left any witnesses, it would lead to war between the Order of Lorelei and Malkuth. How many people were on board? This was a top-secret mission, so only half the usual number. Around 140. Over a hundred people were killed. Let's get going. If we get caught here, the war that follows will claim the lives of many more. Hey, hey, more party members. All right. But what awaits us in St. Bina? Find out next time and let's play Tales of the Abyss 100%. This is Joseph K. signing out. Y'all have a great day and keep it real. Later.